all things work to the good of them that are called according to his purpose. All things work to the good of them that are called, that are called, that are called. All things work to the good of them that are. Anyway, so uh, I, they are brainwashed. So this is Josh there taking coming at you today. How are you doing? Um, so I'm still on the way. I'm I'm just south of Federal Way in Washington State. Yeah, yesterday. Oh, what happened yesterday? Yesterday I woke up. Uh, I forgot to think about this before I got on the videos, and I, I sorry, I just woke up. Um, yeah, I got um, I got a ride. Oh yeah, cause like, so God told me to wake up in the morning. I woke up in the morning. I had to walk all the way across town. I talked to some people, but God had me go all the way across town to get some breakfast. <laughs> I got breakfast about noon, and it was really good. It was fulling, filling, it was Eaton's. And then I had to walk all the way across town again, and I'm like waiting for a, a ride, and I didn't get one, and I was like frustrated. And the guy's like, I didn't tell you to go get a ride, I told you to go talk. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't tell you to go get a ride, I told you to go talk to somebody. So I'm like, okay, where do you want me to go? So I went up, I went up like, I moved over like four blocks, and I got to talk to this dude who got hit by a car. And he wanted to know why God allowed him to get hit by a car and, and, and why bad things were happening to him. And I'm like, dude, you just got to realize that, you know, you're like Job. You know, it's like you can, either, you can either blame God for everything that goes wrong in your life or realize that you're not living for this life, you're living for the next life. And if bad things are happening to you, it just means that you get better rewards in the next one. Uh, he was he was really happy about that, and so I helped. He was in a walker because he was like totally messed up, <laughs> and I guess he had escaped from the hospital to so go smoke cigarettes because they don't let you smoke in, sm in hospitals anymore. So I walked him back. It was pretty cool. He was a good guy. And then after that, I went in. And I got I ride from this dude, uh, the guy in the hospital. His name was Terry, but then I got this guy Ben. He I think he's a Fili Filipino. But he's like you know, American Filipino. He's like I'm American, but you know. Anyway, yeah, uh, he was super cool. Talked a lot. I liked him. But he gave me a ride all the way to, out of Seattle. Finally, I'm out of Seattle and into Federal Way. Now I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing or where I'm supposed to be going. But uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I don't know which way I want to go. South. I'm trying to go south, but I'm thinking if I go over the mountains, I'll get out of the effing rain. I really don't like the rain. The rain is not good. It's it's not good. No, no, I don't like the rain. I spent last night in a freaking doorway. <laughs> it was cold and you was wet, and I don't mind. I don't mind. Well, I wasn't so wet. I mean, I was actually I didn't get drained on at all because it was a pretty it was a pretty deep hallway. But anyway, I still got rain. Uh, it still was cold. So, yeah. Uh -huh. Anyway, you know I love God because I love virtue, justice, and salvation. I will talk at you later. Peace, love, and grooviness forever. Bye-bye.